Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Delver. Uh, we've managed to get to level 4 in the last episode, which is as far as we've got thus far. So, let's see what level 4 holds in store for us. I have a bit of a bad feeling about what's coming. Hopefully it'll be nothing too terrifying, but... Well, yeah, caterpillars. Two caterpillars? Oh no, that's too far. Well, level up, so that's alright. But we have immediately been poisoned. Um, that quilted armour is of no interest. What about that sword? Oh, far, far weaker than our excellent steel dagger. This time, I'm determined not to accidentally press F and full screen the game and thereby stop recording. Because that was deeply irritating. Alright, we've got some cheese. Oh, okay. I don't think we have any wands, but we do have a bow, so let's um, prepare that. No? No? Uh, Alright, switch back to the sword. Okay, we're going to have to stop this trap destroying us by throwing um, this useless bit of armour into it. Oh, it's a teleport trap. All right, well, that's not so bad, but let's run over it anyway while it's harmless. Um, okay, I will take a couple more skulls for trap purposes. Tch, trying to sneak up on me. Good luck. Okay, I'll get the arrows. Seems very dimly lit. I don't remember the previous floors being this gloomy. But that's alright. I don't require good lighting. Okay. Whoa! Okay, it's busy in there. Bow time. I would go for the wand, except I don't think I have any left. Hmm. That doesn't seem to be working. No. Ah, oh, you bastard. There. Oh, one shot. Okay, and you. I see you hiding there. Yeah. Alright. Now let's switch back to the sword for this close-up business. Where is he? There he is. Crap. Oh, piss off. Alright. Back to the bow. See if I can hit this bugger. This is where the darkness starts to um, make things a little tricky. But it's alright. It all worked out in the end. Is that more cheese? Yes. Okay, that's fine. Might have to eat some cheese in a minute. I should probably put... Yeah, I do have a couple of ones. I should probably put one of the ones up here in one of these slots. That sounds like another one of those bastards. Hmm. Perhaps not. Perhaps it was that caterpillar setting off the traps. I don't know. This is the exit from the floor. What the hell? Where are you? Oh, crap. Was that it? Since when do spiders shoot at me? Hmm. Hmm. Right. Aha. A new wand. 2 to 22 lightning damage. That could be good. No room left. Let's drink one of the potions. Which one have we not identified? Well, it doesn't tell you what the identified one is anyway. Let's drink that, remind ourselves. Yum. So, probably nothing. Oh no, it does seem to be having a healing effect, gradually. A regenerative effect, so that's fine. Um, Alright, yes. And um, I suppose move one of these things up there as well. Let's put the cheese up there. And then we'll have room for this delightful wand just here. Okay. Now, <clears throat> yeah, it looks like this floor, <clears throat> excuse me, is just a straight run from the entrance down to here. So let's descend to the next floor. Floor five. Oh, it's looking a bit sewerish. Oh crap! One of them straight away. Let's get the wand out. No. Hmm. Where's it got? There it is. Bastard. Yeah, take that. Alright. So we've got some 6 AC armor. What's my current armor? 5 AC. So that is slightly better. And slightly is enough. Alright, of course I'm going to have to drop something. I'll drop one of these skulls. I don't need that many. And in fact I have some old weapons and things that I don't need. I'll get rid of those as well. Um, 
take this armor, equip it, and drop the old armor. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. We get the wand out again, I think. Whoa! What the hell is that thing? Whatever it was, it's now goo and gore. Okay. This reminds me of um, Final Fantasy XII, maybe? The sewers underneath um, Rabanasta. Right, I've been poisoned, but I'll just have to cope with that. Taking damage is less tolerable. I mean, real damage. Right, I think this weapon I just picked up is actually better than the old one. 9 to 14, 7 to 10. Yes. Oh crap, no. It's slower, actually. Significantly slower, but that's alright. Get rid of those buggers. Um, I think I'm going to have to eat this cheese for some health. So I took a lot of damage just there. Indecent amounts of damage. I shouldn't have taken that much. Okay, there are some arrows, which is good, because I didn't manage to find the ones that I fired off on the last floor. Okay. Long and winding. Not my favourite layout. These worms just poison at the drop of a hat. It's really starting to get on my nerves now. That is at least some sort of regen potion, so that's a good thing. Um, scroll of Greater Health, that could be very useful if they continue taking damage at this rate. Um, all right. I'm going to try out one of these other potions that I haven't tried yet. Number four, Green Potion. You feel better. I would assume then that was a health potion. Whoa, crap! What the hell was that? Was that a teleporter or something? It must have been... Fuck! That thing's shooting at me. No. No. One. Right, here we, here we go. Ugh. Oh, crap. Now the one's out of charges. Okay. Sword time! Ah. Hell, that was horrible. Alright. Um, 9 to 14, and this bugger is eight, uh, 6 to 12. No. I will drop this green wand, because it's now out of charges. I will put the blue wand up here. I'll put the purple potion up here. Um, actually, I think I'll drink one of the red potions first for health. And then I'll put the purple potion up there. Hmm. Okay. Now, was it the potion or a trap that caused me to teleport? 7 AC. I'll take that. Um, so, put that there. Drop that one. Fine. There's some more armor over here as well. More 7 AC, fine. Yeah, looked at that and it doesn't count. So where am I on the map? Okay, I'm all the way over there. Basically by the exit. Which is okay. Okay, this is, I think, where I got to. More or less. Yeah, I don't see a teleporter trap or anything. I suppose there might be one under the water for all I know. I don't know if that's something that the game does. Um, there's also this area we haven't explored here. Um, splashing water looks like an enemy to me, but I suppose it might not be. No, it's just water. Okay. We have been down there, but we haven't been... what, there? Maybe we can't get up there. I wouldn't be surprised. Um, yeah, down this way. And then I think we've pretty much cleaned up this whole floor. I think. Um, yeah, as long as there aren't a billion other enemies to fight. Get back! Get back! Oh. Well, actually, when I say get back, I mean come here. Well, damages, damages. I know the plural of damage isn't damages. At least not in this context, but I don't care, I'm a maverick who plays by his own grammatical rules. Wand! Okay, this wand is not that effective. I kind of suspected that anyway. Shite. Alright, took a lot of damage. Um, yellow potion. It burns. Okay, not not the right potion. Other, other potion. Other potion! Quickly! Three! Regenerate me. Rege oh god, it's not enough. It's not enough. Green potion. Green potion. Three! You feel better! 
Oh, hell. Why, why is there an arrow floating in front of my face? Get away! Okay. I'd better equip another green potion, since that's clearly my health potion. And I'll swap the wand for a more powerful one. I'm going to need it, by the looks of things. Yeah! Look at that. Okay, these swords are not worth picking up. There was another one of those things. Where did it go? No doubt we'll find out any minute. Okay, the food is welcome, considering how much damage I've been taking here. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, back to the sword for now. Okay. Back to the wand, I think. Boom! Yeah. I don't really want to waste wand charges like that, but at the same time, I don't want to just hang on to wands and not use them. That would be silly. This, nothing, just a suspicious looking dead end. Same there. It must be old doom habits or something, but I was expecting there to be a secret door or something. Alright. Get the edible 2D bread. Okay, potion. Fine. And I've been poisoned again. Of course. Fuck me! Alright, I quit. I'm sick of walking on teleporters, I'm just going downstairs. Alright, floor six. And we're still poisoned from the floor above. Um, let's have the purple potion. You feel arcane. So that presumably had some sort of magical effect. Let's eat some cheese for health. I'll put some bread back up, back up there in that slot. And the scroll of greater health for any more emergencies. Because I really could have done with that when I was sustaining all that damage. A new wand. Magic missile. Seems to do a lot of damage, so that's good. That's not as good as my current sword. Haven't done much in the way of um, trap activation recently. Yeah, deliberately activating traps so that I can walk past them. Doesn't seem to have been an issue in the last floor or so. Um, okay, just continue taking these guys out. Yeah, if you can't attack me from a distance, I'm not that concerned. I mean, you are resilient, which is a problem, but still, it's not too bad. Okay, so that is presumably a health potion like the one I'm currently holding, I would guess. Um, okay, another swordsman, zombie, blue-skinned guy. An Asari, perhaps. Dungeon Asari. Right. Kill the bat. Kill the bat! It's only a bat! Come on! Right. That thing as well. Whoa! Head coming through the water. I was wrong, you're not an Asari, you're Zora. Right. Those are both references. Anyone who isn't familiar with other games, don't take me too literally on that front. Um, right. Get back. It's funny that I keep saying, get back, when what I really mean is come here and walk onto my sword. Particularly with the eye things, I go, get back, get back, but the last thing I want them to do is get back, because if they get back, they're harder for me to hit. Anyway, waffle aside, let's keep fighting these Daggerfall rejects. And these Legend of Zelda rejects also. The first Legend of Zelda rejects. Yeah, you're that rubbish. You didn't even make it into the first Zelda. Not that I'm saying the first Zelda is rubbish. I hasten to add. Alright, there's an, uh, a tunnel that we haven't explored. Uh, back this way somewhere. That's not a great sword. Over this way. Here. Oh, it's a dead end. This isn't a tunnel. What are you talking about? 9 to 14? Is that better than my current one? current one is also 9 to 14, so no, it's exactly the same. And as far as I know, there's no, you know, wear and tear uh, on your items in this, so no need to worry about keeping it fresh, replacing it as it gets old. Um, Alright, I think it was this way, was it? To the exit? Oh, shite. Oh, no, get back. See, there I was again. What I mean is... Come here! But I suppose I can't say come here without sending like him trying to be um, Gary Oldman's Dracula. 
See me now. Yes, that was an odd reference. Well done, Alan. All right, what's what's that? That looks like a trap. No, it's not a trap on the wall. It's just a visual design. So this feels a bit templish now, a bit like an ancient ruin. I mean, I suppose strictly speaking, they're probably all ancient ruins. Skeleton, or possibly Pilfrey Doughboy. Okay, lots of wands. Maybe that's what I'll call this episode. Something that refers to the excess of wands and doughboys. Okay. Holy crap! No! Okay, um, that seems to have slowed my movements. Let's drink this green potion for health. Get out the black wand. And then BOOM! Didn't kill him? Just knocked him back! Shite. Right. Are these better than my current trousers? No, they're worse than my current trousers. They match my shirt, but that's not enough. I'm not that superficial. Okay, lava pits. That's new. Haven't seen those before in this game. Oh, this feels very doomy. Being able to see through a window to a different area that you can't reach yet. I know I've been referencing Doom a lot in this game, but there are elements of it that definitely remind me of Doom. Ugh. Fleeing into a corner. Rookie mistake. Okay, so we've introduced a key finding mechanic here. It's nice that the game is actually introducing new mechanics, even if they're still quite simple, straightforward ones. It's nice that it's not just exactly the same all the way through. Kill. Good. Okay, I'm going to eat my bread to try and restore some of this health that I'm hemorrhaging. Almost literally. Um, this is becoming quite maze like That looks very suspicious. E to open? No. Um, Alright. Yeah, it looks like a network of tunnels to the left here. Just all over the place. Aha! So here's the place we could see but not get to. We already have better armour than that. So, not bothered. Um, where's another tunnel? This way? Uh, we've already come this way. But then we've already come all the ways, pretty much. Uh, what about that? Is that a dead end or an unfollowed tunnel? It's a dead end. So, we're going to have to find a way to open this gate. Hmm. Alright, where haven't we gone that we can get to? There might be another tunnel off here, at the far end, by the looks of it. No, that's a lava pit. I can't go down there. Hmm. Hmm. Alright. Let's try anything that looks remotely like a dead end. So there's one uh, just this way. No, that's not really a dead end. Well, I mean, it is really a dead end. That's what I'm getting out here. Let's go around the corner. Here. Is this... Ah, tunnel. Excellent. So hopefully the key will be down here somewhere. Dark potion. That's not very politically correct. Sorry, it's, um, I associate the word dark at times with... Um, Someone I used to share a house with who thought it was more correct to call people dark. Yeah. I, I lived in the 20s. I don't know if you knew that. Okay. Oh, he was standing on a plinth dramatically. Who the hell do you think you are? The skeleton of Conan. You're the Pillsbury Doughboy. Alright, there's my key. Yeah. Alright, so now we just have to find our way back to that locked gate thing, which should be somewhere down here. Yeah, that's the way. Alright, pop it open. And of course there's a fight! I'm the gatekeeper! Uh, uh, uh. And I'm the keymaster, evidently. I did find one, after all. I could have delivered that joke better, but what the hell? You're not here for quality joke delivery. 
You're here for so far. You're here for the profanity, evidently. Oh, no buggering charges. I'm not entirely sure what a buggering charge is, but fine. Oh, goodbye, Delver. Better luck next life. And I thought we were doing quite well up to that point. Well, anyway, rejoin me the next time round when we start again at floor one and see if we can at least equal our previous feat. Maybe this time I'll be a bit more prepared for all the Pillsbury Doughboys and flying, glowing blue head things. Anyway, thanks for watching, as usual. Come back next time to see how all that goes. Until then, bye for now.